Hello, Mr. Arca here, and very quickly, we're gonna make a parkour mod. Very, so you can see sort of how it works. Like, all this extra stuff gets very overwhelming, you know? But let's see, how much of this do you really need to make a parkour mod? All right, let's place our first object, hit enable. Here's our first object. Now, we need a starting platform for our people to start their parkour mod on, so let's make it a little wider using the scale is what you use to scale your object and now it's set to seven 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 by seven uh, uh that's a good size let's move it forward a little bit yeah, yeah. Mm, 10 all right so this is their starting platform let's raise it up using the scale right now i have on the lowest uh, quality because i can work faster when there's no lag all right this is the starting platform this is the colors you can find the color chart on in the market on the side uh the side uh tool link bar thing on the forums but i'm just gonna put it in as a random color for now let's do 100 100 100 for, for gray using the advanced tab you can reposition tori and ook with these axis numbers so oh, that was too far let's do 10 all right let's put tori right here position him stop it right now oh no he's in the box all right that's good enough all right so this is the starting platform let's start with a jump up to another platform duplicate i hit the duplicate button to duplicate this box so now i got two of them what <laughs> that was disgusting all right uh 20. now he's gonna run and jump over 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 to this one make it smaller bring it oh no bring it in a little bit oh. Let's do 18. No, that's way too close. It's like a little, it's a little skip. 19. That's cool. All right, so now we have a jump over to this box. And then we're going to make another thing here. A little too thick. And raise it up like this. Go to 50. And then this goes over here. Shh. Shh. 20. No, no, no. No, oh my god, don't want this edge to be sticking out like this because that's gonna look stupid. So you said this, sorry, wrong one. Uh, uh, six. So now you have this, change it to a 150. So now we have this little vault thing. It's gonna jump over, vault over this. Now we can be vault over to, oh, and go 10 by 10. That's not what I wanted. But this is actually what I did want. So now you vault over onto that and go up to there. Now you're like, what? I'm on something tall now? How do I get down? I'll show you how to get down. Let's make a slide thing. Right? Oh, there it is. So now to make a slide, we need to move this. I keep going the wrong direction, man. All right, that's way too steep. Now it's way too flat. All right, let's go forward. Now we have to line this up. Let's go negative. No, no, no. All right, that's good enough. Now let's thin it out like that and then make it a zero here. And now we have a uh, jump over this, vault up to that, and then you jump down here. Now it's not slippery yet. So you go to, uh, the advanced tab it changes the friction to zero and now you can just simply slide down it because that changes the friction of it cool now let's well that's in the ground let's just make a little platform to go on to oh 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 i'm just trying to cover up the main parkour obstacles like we have hop a vault, a slide, climby thing, a swing pole. All right, let's do that. We do a cylinder. Whoa, make it smaller. I put it to 10, raise it out of the ground for a bit. Now go over here. Go forward, 26, 26, 25, 26, 25. All right, 
um, and duplicate. Put another one over here. Come on. All right, there we go. Change it to 25. I don't care. Colors aren't important. So you jump up to that then. Uh, I need to size it up because I don't know how tall Tori is. So Tori, get up here. 30, 25. There we go. Then you go put him up to 550. 540, 530, 520, 525. All right, 26 will do. All right, so need to put it at the right height so like someone can realistically reach this thing. All right, objects, duplicate, rotation, boom. Oh, that was the wrong rotation. There we go. Put it right in the middle, lower it. Lower it. Wait a second, is that? This is not centered. All right, now you swing off of that, slide down, and stick the landing. Bounce. All right, let's make a bounce pad. So a little bit more above the ground. I don't see a lot of these in mods. No one uses bounce anymore. Bring bounce back. Make bounce great again. Then you go here, you set the bounce to, I don't know, like 40? No, like. 10. I don't know how bouncy that is. Let's test it. <gasps> I forgot to make everything static. Don't forget that, guys. Don't forget to make everything static in your mod, or you're gonna just blow everything up and maybe even crash it if you've done enough. Luckily, I've not done enough to crash my game. <laughs> now, let's test this bounce pad. Did you see that? Did you see that little bounce? That was a bounce. <laughs> see how quickly I just threw all this together? Like this isn't even like a mod, like a, like, a, like a mod mod, but this is like a mod, you know? This is like the the bread and butter of just making mods, you know? Like I don't get why everyone says it's so difficult because it's not difficult. I think everyone's just a little lazy and easily stressed out and easily overwhelmed because there's so much in here that you don't need to use. You know, all you need is this. You just need to make your objects, size your objects, color your objects, make sure there's, <laughs> make sure there's static and then just keep duplicating and resizing and building upon each other and you'll have a mod, you know? Like this bar is just three, just three cylinders I have placed together after resizing them. This thing is just a box turned sideways in the ground that you slide on. Like it's not, it kept, if you guys have played with Legos before, you guys are probably a lot more imaginative and creative than you give yourself credit for. And I think you should just try, you know, I mean like the tutorial bash is kind of like not the most, al most alive right now, but you know, you can still do great things with the tools given here. Um, not very difficult at all. Not very difficult. And the, the lack of just mod makers out there is just, oh, it's just overwhelming, you know? Just the amount of people who just can't make mods. And it's not that you can't make mods, it's just that you don't want to try. You know, you're not putting in the time to just like give it some effort. I made this like in six or seven minutes here. And this isn't like a great mod, but like, this is like a good like beginner start to understand like how like obstacle progression works. You jump off of this, you vault off of that, and then you jump on this bar and you swing. You wanna to chain together things, like, like, just like that. And if you don't have inspiration to come up with things out of your brain, then look up real life structures and real life parkour areas. Watch parkour compilations, find different things, but that's just how I'm basically gonna break down how to make mods or start making mods at least. But yeah, that, that is it. And I'll catch you later on more in-depth stuff about mod making.